Hello and welcome. In this short tutorial, I'll be showing you how to download and use our desktop application. The GameBench Toolkit allows you to measure and capture key metrics, including frames per second, CPU, GPU, network, and memory. Using the desktop app, you can analyze the data and use it to optimize and improve your app's performance. Using our desktop application, you'll be able to see live metrics and detailed analysis of your apps. One of the most important features of our desktop application is the ability to profile the performance of your iOS device. To download the desktop app, all you need to do is create an account. Step one is to go to www.gamebench.net and create an account. Step two is to check for the verification email and activate your account. Please note this may appear in your junk folder. Step three is to go back to the GameBench website and click login at the top right and sign in with your new credentials. Step four, once logged in, click the desktop app located in the download section at the top of the page. Choose your operating system and then click download. On the left hand side here, you can see our helpful setup instructions guiding you how to get set up and how to prepare your devices for recording. There is also a more in-depth guide which can be found at docs.gamebench.net. Once everything is prepared, launch our GameBench application and log in using your details. If you want to record a session on Android using the desktop app, you must first enable USB debugging on your device. If you want to record iOS, you must first install iTunes on your computer if it's not already there, and download the developer disk image file found on the third step of setup instructions. It is important that you do not unzip this folder, as it will not work. Once you log in and connect an iOS device or Android device, a pop-up will appear asking you where you place the developer disk image. Confirm the location and that's it, you're ready to record. Now all you need to do is connect your Android or iOS device. For an iOS device, you may be asked to trust this computer if you haven't used it before. Once you connect your device via USB, your list of apps will start loading. Next, just select which device you want to test, select what app you want to test, then click record and start profiling in real time with live metrics. To stop recording, just click the button again for a second time. If you have any more questions or would like more information, you can visit our getting started guide or support documentation, both found on docs.gamebunch.net. Thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next video.